Alright, welcome back to my Assassin's Creed Odyssey, The Fate of Atlantis walkthrough, episode 3, called Judgment of Atlantis. Yes, this is indeed the final DLC of Assassin's Creed Odyssey. This is part 2. There we go. Let's talk to Atlas. We are right where we left off, so yeah, let's do it. He is right inside this door here. Yep. Let's see what he wants. Here we go. Ah, you've arrived! I'm honored that the Castis would accept my humble request. Ah, your Atlas, I take it. In the flesh. I thank you for coming to see me. I'm sure you're very busy. The burden my father gave you is not a light one. I seem to have a lot to do around here, thanks to Poseidon. But if I can help, I will. A noble pursuit. As my messenger stressed, the situation is dire. The Vicastis is just who I need. Well, here I am. It's my brothers, the Archons. They have issues with the human populations under their control. Tensions between Isu and humans are mounting. Without order, the problems will grow severe. I'll try and use my position to help them where I can. Find Hadiros, Amphiris, and Azeas. Through your shining example, I hope they learn the valuable lessons in discipline they so desperately need. And if I help them, you're hoping it'll maintain the peace between Isu and humans. That's the plan. Poseidon should have known they weren't ready for the responsibility an Archon bears, but that's his failing. Tell me about Gaviros. You'll find him near the arena, hard at work planning his next exhilarating spectacle, I'm sure. What should I know about Amphiris? He's probably off terrorizing people near the fortified Doma of Ochtonos. Make sure you don't sneak up on him, he's quite jumpy. What about Azais? Who is he? You'll find dear Azais wherever there is humanitarian work to be done. I heard there were some issues near the Doma of Amphiris. We have Archons where I'm from. Do they fulfill the same duties? They are charged with overseeing and ruling the humans of Atlantis. Ensuring all live comfortably and peacefully. A job at which I fear they're failing. There always seems to be unrest between the two races. The Underworld and Elysium were no different. Time passes and tensions keep building. I expected my father to handle it. But Atlantis grows steadily worse, and no one wants to see what could happen if precautions are not taken. I'll find the Archons, and make sure their problems are taken care of. <clears throat> Okay, um, I guess we're going this way. Uh, let me just see here. A couple of new quests here. Yeah, I guess we'll do this one first. Uh, let me just check where it is. Yeah, okay, it's a bit far, so I guess I'll see you guys there, as usual. You know, you know the drill. You know, instead of traveling the entire way, I'll just cut that part out. So yeah, um, give me a couple of seconds and I'll see you guys there, alright? Be right back. Alright, here we go. Um, here is the first Archon. Let's talk to him and see what's up. In here somewhere, come on. There we go. Do I need to kill these guards or can I just walk Alice? Let's try walk past them. Oh, all right. There we go. Nice. Ah, oh, the Castis! Thank the stars. I was beginning to lose all hope. Atlas said you needed help. You don't understand the responsibility on my shoulders. It's my job to concoct entertainment for the masses. But I fear the crowd have grown bored of my grand spectacles. I've seen some good plays. 
and some bad ones. We need more than a simple play. If the audience leave my shows bored and restless, who knows what they'll start plotting? You think they'll become violent? My purpose is to keep them preoccupied so they can't be violent. If your shows have become boring, you just need to get more creative. <sighs> the humans are primitive. Their taste's basic. They like life's simpler joys. Blood, tragedy, romance, that sort of thing. So give the people what they want. What they want, yes. Yes, I can hear the tears now. The legendary De Castis Cassandra takes on Atlantis's finest warriors. You must take part in my next event. Sounds like a Pangration. I can definitely help with that. Not exactly. But I was inspired by your efforts in Elise. I know you'll do an exemplary job entertaining the crowds as you did then. If we pull this off, we'll be the talk of the city. It's worth a try. Okay. Alright, let's just eliminate two guards with arrows to please the crowd. Uh, ah. Yeah, let's just... Do I have to do that? I mean, I don't have the best bow, that's why I'm asking. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, we can still... It, it isn't, you know, mission failed or anything, so... Alright, uh, hopefully this will do as well. I'll leave a link down in the description, guys, as usual, if you guys want to check out the previous video, how we got to Atlantis from the underworld, you know? Since we are, indeed, in Atlantis now. So yeah, I'll leave a link down below, check it out if you like. Or any other Assassin's Creed video, of course. Our but now, next challenge fast approaches. A champion bested by none in the city. No mercy, no guilt. Will this be too much for even the Dicasis to overcome? All right, dude, bring it on. Bring it. I, I don't know why, but something feels a bit odd here. I mean, I'm slaughtering guards here, like nothing. So... Didn't Poseidon say that we can't, you know... Well, okay, he did say no experiments, but still. <laughs> slaughtering people like nothing... This is a regular human, that's why I'm a bit concerned here. Wow. Oh, come on! Dude. That's it. Here we go. I kinda wish that this attack I'm doing right here, I forgot what it's called, oh yeah, Bloodline's Rampage, uh, we did get it from uh, the Bloodline DLC, that it did a bit more damage, since it is a warrior build skill, and I'm, I have a warrior build, it's a bit, yeah, I'm, I'm kinda surprised that it doesn't do more damage, to be fair. Alright, let's see. has been bested! Our mighty Dicastis is victorious and the crowd have spoken. But will she show mercy or will she spill the blood we want? If you don't appease the crowd, I fear what Gadiros will do. It was an honor to fight you, Dicastis. You don't deserve to die just for losing. Our merciful Dicastis has passed judgment. But, do not dismay! Our champion lives to fight another day for you, the audience! And here we are! The end of today's event! Next to phase out the Castis' judgment, the very scum that taints our city! By the gods, 
What is this? For the good of Atlantis. Today, bear witness to the guilty and condemned given one final chance at redemption. They will be honored to die at the hands of our guest. Enough! I am not doing this. Mm. Uh, fear not, friends. We will make sure justice is delivered. Well, that was an unmitigated disaster. You said fight, so I fought. The problem is that I didn't say fight. I said be as entertaining as possible. If this kind of entertainment keeps the peace, then maybe it has value. The games have failed. The humans are restless, and it's only a matter of time before they make their own entertainment. Their hunger for violence is insatiable. You just need to keep surprising them. Think like a human, not an issue. That's what I tried to do. But you showed the criminals mercy, and the crowd reacted as I expected. Killing people who can't defend themselves isn't entertainment, it's slaughter. Their sacrifice helps us keep the peace and maintain order. Or it would have if you played along. What are you saying, Radiros? That my grand experiment has failed. There's nothing left to be done but start again and try for better results. The arena must be cleared. Okay, uh, is that it? Yeah, crowd pleaser. Okay, yeah, I guess we failed on that one. I mean, but still, I'm not going to kill innocent people. Really not. Um, what's next? Let's see. Uh, we do have two more of the Archons to deal with. Um, I guess we'll do the closer one. Why not? This one? Let yeah. Okay, it's over there. So, yeah, it's a bit far again. So... Yeah, I'll get, I'll see you guys there as always, you know. Yeah. So I'll be right back. Here we are, a bit closer at least. <laughs> okay, where is this guy? Azaz. There we are. Azaz, a physician and an archon. Alright, what's next? What have I missed? What must I do? Azais? You have your hands full. Vigastis, you're a welcome sight. The only one I've had in some time. So many sick. I'm surprised that anything can spread in a place as advanced as this. Oh, it's shocking. Nothing I have tried will cure the sick or stop the pathogen spreading. I've lost so many already. When did you first notice people were getting sick? At the start of this cycle. It began quite slowly and I didn't think much of it. But then the cases grew rapidly day by day. The more that fell sick, the faster the pathogen spread. You seem really worried. Have you ever seen a sickness like this before? No. There are many odd phenomena during this cycle. Plants dying, strange insects and animal attacks. I worry about what this could signify. Don't worry. We'll find a way to stop the sickness. Tell me what you need. Well, there was a device being worked on by a scientist named Consus. Its intention was to rapidly heal injuries and eradicate disease. Was? His device is missing. The scientists here have tried to replicate it based on the schematics, but it's still in the experimental phase, and it hasn't been tested on humans. So it may not work. That's not the biggest issue. Poseidon has outlawed the use of our technology on humans. I fear that if we don't act quickly, the pathogen will spread across Atlantis. If you think this healing device can help the sick, then I'll make sure that you have it. The wisdom of an issue, but the compassion of a human. 
You were a good choice for the Gustis. You'll find the device in one of the issue laboratories in the Consus archive. All right, uh, retrieve the ISO device. No problem. Um, it doesn't look that far, so I guess we'll just get there with Phobos. No problem at all. Um, come on, man. So, as you guys can see, I did change the skin on Phobos again. Um, I do think that this looks a bit more... It does fit in more with Atlantis, you know? So, yeah. Maybe not my armor, but still. This is the coolest armor in the game, if you ask me. Okay, yeah, I guess we can just go down here. Yeah. Here we are. Can I enter? Yeah. Alright. <laughs> okay. Let's see, we do have a captain here. We might as well clear this area out. I mean, we'll see, but... If it is a labyrinth, I don't know, but... We'll see. We Let's take care of the guards first. Uh, oh yeah, uh, make sure to leave a like on this video, guys. And subscribe, of course, if you're new to this channel. I really do appreciate it. Keeps me motivated, you know, to keep making videos for y'all. Um, I try to upload every single day. But yeah. Here we are. Okay, let's just... Yeah, a stealth attack should do it. I don't think I would kill him. Either way, with one, you know, throwing the spear at him. Whoa, there we go. Come on. Yeah, the bloodline, Rage of the Bloodline doesn't do the trick, man. I don't know why. Okay, is that all the guards? Yeah. Okay, we need to get into this room somehow. Alrighty. Guess we go this way. Oh, one more. Here we go. Is this a chest or Okay, Admant Ingot. And here's a note. Okay. Did get a new quest as well. This can be used to create What now? I have to find this place. Retrieve the Isu Okay, that was not the Isu advice. Uh device. Eh. Let's see. What am I missing here? Come on. Ah, here we go. Does make things a bit easier. Yeah. Exploration area. No, okay. Here's a chest. Alright. There we go. Ah, here it is. Yes, yeah, someone has done some experiments on humans here. That's a body. Yeah. I mean, I feel like we need to do this, you know. There's a lot of people getting sick. So I don't really care if we, you know, break Poseidon's rule. To not experiment on humans, I mean, if this could same, save humans, why not do it, you know? There we go. Since we are trying to be a good person as Cassandra. One thing I have been thinking about is, you know, to restart the whole game and do, you know, all the bad choices with, uh, perhaps, Alexios, for example. <laughs> yeah, that would be fun, actually.
Here we go. Okay, location completed. Nice. Uh, you know what? I will guess I'll see you guys back there. Um, at least a bit closer, since I don't really know. Y yeah. I'll need to go around the whole area, so... Okay, here we are. Let's see. I guess we'll just deliver this and then we'll wrap this up. That's through... Yeah, two quests completed at least, so yeah. I've brought the... Uh... Glowing cloth you've asked for. It's a nanotech matter regenerator, in fact. But you have it. I can't believe it. Now then, let's see what this thing can do. What the fuck did you do? I thought I had calibrated correctly. Oh no, what have I done? I killed this poor human. The device doesn't work and you stole it against Poseidon's laws. What do we do now? This device is your only chance of stopping the sickness. You need to keep trying. Yes, you're right. Not trying will just mean more innocent lives are lost. I think if I make some adjustments, I can get it to function on humans correctly. It seems to be looking much better. Well, almost everyone. The device still needs work, but it has incredible potential. Poseidon won't be happy that we broke his law. But I'm glad you were the one to do it, and not me. In any case, I'm eternally grateful for your help. Thank you. Wow, okay, yeah, that human did explode, but at least we saved the rest of them. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's it for this video. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Ooh, nice, level up. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys soon. Take care, peace, and bye.